Hello everybody, this is Maximum Donut. Welcome to an episode of Maximum Donut Plays Spelunky, also known as Maximum Donut Plays Holy Shit Something Other Than Dark Souls. So uh, I'm going to be trying out um, Spelunky today. I've actually put quite a few hours into it already and have yet to reach the final boss, so I'm quite bad at this game. Just um, fair warning. Uh, for those of you <laughs> who don't know what a uh, Spelunky is, it's a um, it's a 2D platformer, I guess, that's been released on Xbox Live uh, Arcade. And yeah, it's um, ooh, wait, what is this? Ooh, freeze ray. Okay. And so the objective of this game basically is to reach the end so you start from like a door which is closed off I guess and then you aim to reach the very end of the level without dying you have uh, certain items you have bombs and you have ropes that you can use to try and get through the level and you can pick up money as well or gems which are equi equivalent to money um, which you can use in shops like this one so there I used a rope you can use to buy things. So I bought the climbing gloves which basically lets me uh, grab the side of walls and things. I'm actually pretty decked out with my um, with my items at the moment actually. Um, this run is going surprisingly well which is generally a good indicator that something is about to go terribly wrong particularly since um, I'm terrible at playing this game. Uh, or rather I'm just not patient enough yeah, um, I sort of constantly hold down the run button and it does lead to my death quite a significant amount of the time. But I never learn because, well, I'm some kind of moron. But anyway. Alright, we're actually chugging along pretty well. We haven't picked up any uh, damsels. So damsels are, you can choose them to be dogs or women or men, whichever um, you prefer, I guess. Dubious here. Oh god. Okay. And um, they can basically. That went incredibly well. So um, if you take them all the way to the exit, they give you a extra bit of health, which is very nice. There's a locked chest there, which you can um, unlock with a key to get the Ujat Eye. There's actually an opportunity for us to get a little bit of extra health here. Okay, and I lose it straight away. Alright, that's good stuff. So, the objective of this game is to work through the various levels and um, get to the end. And there is an end boss fight, as I've seen in other people's uh, playthroughs. Not my own playthrough, because I've actually never gotten there before. Um, whether or not that makes me a complete noob, well, that's up for debate, but I would say... <laughs> oh my god. I would say uh, with a firm whole heart, yes, it does. Although, you guys should be aware that this game is hard as balls. If your balls are incredibly hard. Although, if they are... You should probably get checked out by some kind of medical professional. Because, in general, I don't think that's the uh, correct state of affairs. Just, uh... Ooh, okay. So, um... While... <laughs> um... While these enemies, by and large, do one bit of damage each... There are certain things in this game, there are quite a number of things in this game actually, that will uh, kill you instantly. For example, uh, those spikes. And explosions. And also getting frozen. Oh no, 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 I'm not gonna jump down there. Those uh, various other things can do. <laughs> Did I take damage? Various other things do a little bit more damage. Oh god. Oh my goodness. How did I survive that? 
Like those uh, arrow traps, which look like lions that shoot uh, arrows out their mouths, they do uh, two points of damage, which is very bad news. And so I'm on uh, one health at the moment, which basically means anything and everything will kill me. Look at that. And I got killed by a piranha. Up to 37 deaths now uh, in total in this game, which is alright. And we'll just uh, do a quick restart and hope to the high heavens that we can do slightly better. Although it's been a sort of continuing trend here for me that I only get up to the jungle before dying. I have been doing some co-op with my brother, to which I've been getting... Uh, wow, that worked out surprisingly well. Um, I've been only getting to the temple, and usually when I have been getting to the temple, I've just been... Hmm... Well, dead for the most of the level. With my brother um, sort of carrying my dead body around. Well, not literally. Figuratively. Alright, just going nuts in the shop because... Wow. That was a stroke of good fortune for me. Wow. So I'm getting really lucky with my items here. So that those green gloves are the climbing gloves that allow you to just grab onto edges. I wanted to trigger that arrow trap there. Okay, no other choice. Gonna have to use a rope to get up. Uh, which is well worth <laughs> with my dog. So this is the thing I was explaining to you guys before about how um you can take this thing to the end of the level and you'll get a little bit of extra help. Get a few extra bombs, not too shabby. Alright, we'll just move on here. Alright, and there's the exit. Chugging along nicely. Chugging along nicely, indeed. Okay. And we have a key there. We can open a chest, get the Ujat Eye, which you can use to... Get to the city of gold if you have 50,000 gold when you get to the black market. And for those of you who are... Oh, Jesus, no! Okay, I do actually need to kill this guy. Alright, so those are spiked shoe item. That spiked shoe item I have. Which, um, you can tell which items you have uh, underneath the health and the bomb number that you have. That indicates that uh, I will be doing more damage when I jump on things. So it's well worth a uh, bomb to get a crate here. Because crates um, can give you ropes. I am thinking about getting some extra health since I don't plan on going to the City of Gold. Yep. Alright. And we're doing really well. We have 5 health, 12 bombs, 6 ropes. And as soon as I say that I'm uh, that we're doing well, the game just fucks me with this shit. All right. So God damn it. <laughs> Alright, we'll just uh, quickly uh, restart here. I don't know why I did that. Oh, I suppose I could use the arrow. Okay, so that basically sums up my... Uh, the entirety of my experience with Spelunky at the moment. Uh, me just, like, doing okay and then just making stupid, stupid rush decisions. And dying. Paying the ultimate price for it. Uh, I could have easily turned that run into a run where I get to the very end, but instead I just ate a big gold bag of shit. Alright, oh well. Yeah, that spider ate a bag. And I missed out a bit of gold at the end there, but that's okay. I think the, each of the gold bars are worth one, uh, 500 gold each. Oh, I really want that cape. If only... <laughs> Yep, if only I 
been diligent and actually picked up that gold, well, I would not even be close, but oh, well, slightly closer, I guess. Although, after this area, I may... No, I don't think I'll be able to... Alright. Well, let's just uh, move along here. So, that was a shopkeeper who... Oh, Jesus. That... This is a tense moment. So, that was an example of a shopkeeper who... Um, and sell you items. Oh, wow, that was uh, surprisingly. And everything turned out better than expected. So shopkeepers, as uh, would intuitively be interpreted, as you would be able to surmise from the name of the thing, you can buy things from them with the money that you Spent so much time earning. Okay, can't do anything here. Actually, um, maybe if I can peg... No, fuck it. Fuck it! <gasps> Alright, we have a little bit more money now. We can... Alright, we can buy a bomb bag. And we can buy a paste. I'd really love some climbing gloves. But after the game sort of handed it to me for two games in a row, I think... Oh, Jesus, no! Myself, didn't I? All right, well, let's put a bomb there. I think I. Oh no, I placed it properly. Okay. We get a parachute out of it. Parachute just means when we're about to take fall damage, it will prevent us from. <laughs> Did not want the rat. Actually, uh, I'll go put the dog in the hole first. Then we'll go over here. Get all this filth. Alright, and then we will head to the exit. I just missed another gold bar there, but who cares? Who cares? <sighs> Alright, chugging along nicely. Might buy another bomb bag. Um, I think I misplayed this game a little bit because uh, I really love just abusing the shit out of bomb. Oh, actually, since the shopkeeper was up there, there should be no trouble with doing this. Alright, so uh, this... Oh, <laughs> I think it should be... Oh, wow. I am... Um... <laughs> so this idle thing, or this... Golden head is worth, I think, 10,000? Yeah, I think it's worth... Oh my god. Alright, well, we're fine. We're fine. Okay. I think it's... Yeah, I believe it's worth 10,000. No, it's only worth 5,000. Um, is it worth trying to bomb my way through to get those? Uh, I don't think it is. Alright, we're doing alright here. Oh wow, we actually reached the jungle. Okay, so this is pretty much the furthest I've gotten uh, solo. Um, I think I've made it to... F uh, to... Yeah, I don't really want to deal with that. Hmm... Just waste bombs galore. Actually, why don't I just bomb my way through the floor? I don't think that will... I don't think that drop will kid would kill me. Whoops! <laughs> and wasting bombs is my forte, apparently. Okay. That is a really dickish place to put the exit, but oh, good grief. Okay, surviving here. Doing alright, not lost too much health. I hear rushing water. Ah, uh, you are. Uh, you're just hearing is me piercing my pants. Alright. I hate these freaking. Oh, I did not know you could do that actually. And everything turned out worse than expected! Actually, everything turned out better than expected. Okay. 
So this is a boomerang, which is a weapon, basically. You can launch it and it comes back to you as boomerangs generally tend to do. I'm, I'm gonna buy all of these bombs. <sighs> okay. Actually, is it will probably be to my advantage to bomb right here. Pick up the dog. Oh god. Wow, that was a pretty MLG shot for her, actually. Alright, drop the boomerang down there. Grab Le Dug. Which is a uh, dog in French. Ha <laughs> ha! Just joking, I don't know French. Alright, this kind this situation really worries me actually. Oh, there's the exit there in the most uh Okay then Fuck! Fuck! No, 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 no Have you guys had enough of this yet? Cause I sure haven't. Alright, we'll do one more run here. <laughs> oh, God. Just when I think everything is going swell. Alright. Uh, as much as I really enjoy playing this game, the one thing that... Oh, shice. One thing that I think this game really lacks is... Uh, multiplayer actually because um, we'll just drop our dog here he'll walk into the exit and we can come over here and bomb to get all that treasure so um, it'd be really fun actually to play this game um, online with your friends but it only does um, it only does local multiplayer which is kind of shitty and for it whoo for a game that was um, that's this well developed, I mean, I don't really see why it couldn't be um, done online. Actually, I don't know if any arcade games are available online. Fuck it. Okay. Um, yeah, can any of the arcade games be played online? I'm fairly certain they can, so I don't really see why they wouldn't allow... Oh, God damn it. Why they wouldn't have a um, online multiplayer function, but... All right, we'll buy some, buy some, buy the climbing gloves and some ropes. Oh, you are joking! Okay, we have a chance to get the paste here. So, if you um, oh, I fucked up! I fucked up! I fucked up! I lost the torch too. Wait. Oh, this is bad news. Oh, this is terrible news. Alright. Skeleton's coming to life. Bat's coming to murder me. I have no idea where I'm where I can possibly go. Ooh! Oh Jesus! Wow. So I'm pretty much screwed right here, and uh I am Wow, I cannot believe I made that. I can't believe I made it through alive. Okay, it's just pr and then <laughs> and this bat ends my run. I bet no, nope. I bet you that spitter will though. Mm, I'm kind of terrified of all of these areas. Okay. Maybe I can, maybe I can make it fall on the spikes. Come on now. Actually, I could probably just bomb it. And I helped nothing. I helped no one. Ah, uh, and on that note, thank you guys for watching a A bunch of fails and if you guys enjoyed this um, I don't know please leave some comments and 
Otherwise, I'll um, I don't know. I'll probably make a few more episodes of Spelunky yet. If you guys enjoy this kind of stuff, please let me know. And uh, oh, for those of you who are um, worried that I'm going to be uh, uploading less Dark Souls or something, uh, never fret or no need to fret because uh, I will still be uploading Dark Souls uh, at a, on a regular basis as I have been doing for the last few months. So as always. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next episode of Donut Fails at Spelunky.